Hi and welcome to the video. In this video I'm just going to show you how to add related products to your product pages in your Fastos e-commerce website builder store. So this would be so for example if you wanted to drive sales of additional products or if you had other related products that you think your customers might find helpful or be interested in. So let's get started. I'm already logged into my account here uh, as we can see. Now to add a related product we're going to go to catalog and products I'm going to add some related products to these apples here. So what we can do is from here, go to related products. And this is where we're going to start adding these products. So before I do go through this, I'm just going to show you how this apples page looks on my store. So if we just go through here. So as we can see at the moment, here's the apples and you can see the description. There's nothing to do with related products there. So let's go back in here and assign a couple of products. So a good couple of options here and um, we can select the ones we want from here. So let's go with blueberries, uh, grapefruit, some other fruits that other people might be interested in. And um, we can add those. You can tick a check as many as you want. If you click the little blue plus there, it's only going to add whatever whichever one you click the blue plus for so just be careful of that that's even if you've got multiple checked it can be a bit annoying sometimes so just make sure you add products from down here and one other thing that was worth noting here is you've got link back selected items as related to this product so if i have that checked now uh, for these products that i check so say i checked uh, oranges and raspberries for example within oranges and raspberries it would check back the apples on those products too so related product for oranges would be apples and the same for raspberries it would just be apples okay so okay we just add those as well why not so we've got these added now so we're going to click save and until you click save it won't actually make it live so we'll click save and go here and if we just refresh this page we're going to have some uh, some nice related products here so here we go, you may also like, and also if we add those to bag, oh, it's, uh, medium apples, I think I might have done that in a previous video. So now if we go to checkout now, those related products will also be in there. So if you've got multiple products in your cart, um, that would just take a selection of the related products from those packages. You can also turn this off and I'll show that in a second, but that's how you add related products. So let's go ahead and just delete a couple of these. And what we can also do is we could display random products. So I've purposely left two there, but if I choose five, it might not fit on the page. It depends on uh, how, how, how big the screen size of your customer is and things like that. But if we just have uh, five from our fruit category, let's go with vegetables just so we can actually see the random ones. And if we click save now, what that's gonna do is it's gonna leave my two related products. Let's go back to the apples. Uh, my two related products, let's just refresh this. Did I save? Yes, I think I did. And as we can see, grapefruit and limes are the two that I actually had selected. And then the five random ones after um, that will be generated when the page loads. Okay, so that's how you add related products. Now I did say I'd show you how to turn it off in uh, the shopping cart if you find it's a bit overpower overbearing on your customers. So all you've got to do is go to um, go to uh, settings here, cart and checkout, and uh, we can scroll down here, and we can turn it off here on cart page under related products. Now I can't turn it off on product details page because it's live at the moment. I'd have to go back and remove all the related products to be able to uncheck that. But that's how you do it. And that's the end of the video. Thank you very much for watching. Goodbye for now.